Today we are going to be operating the Waterworld Sledgehammer. This is also the car ferry that takes us between the Billionaire's Island, which is right over there in the far distance. As you can see, we're about 13 nautical miles off that shore, and we got to transport all the vehicles. So there's going to be a bunch of people that are going to start showing up here. Uh, we are on schedule for 8.30 a.m. So in about 15 minutes, cars are going to start rolling up, and they got to pay for their ticket. It's $10.00. And then they can get through, load up the car, and we could take four vehicles on this entire sledgehammer we caught. I mean, there's only one, two, three, and four car spots. We can't really fit five. It's just kind of also too much weight. But uh, we drive it up top here. We're the captain of this, so let's climb up and check it out. As you can see, we've got pretty much every electronic you would need on a boat. We've got even actually the center seat, so we could see the cars loading up. And we got tons of cameras. We've got a bow thruster. Really easy to control this boat. And it's got a radar. Look at the exhaust. It's pretty cool. So, yeah, we're going to wait for some cars to show up. And when they do, guys, we'll check in with you. And we get all four, the first four loaded up. We will head out to the island. If you guys are excited for this episode, drop a like down below and subscribe if you haven't already. Well, anyhow, while we wait, we're going to go ahead and turn on the uh, turn on the sledgehammer here. We're going to get the engines warmed up. There is a power of twin MTU diesel engines, 2,000 horsepower. Oh, who is this guy think he is? He's trashing my cones. Oh, my gosh. He just ran over a second one. All right. Keep it straight, buddy. Oh, my gosh. All right. Let's go direct him onto the ship. Hey, 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 hey. hey. Hold on. Be very, very careful loading on here. Just straight. Yep. Little left. Little left. There you go. And you're going to be loading up in spot number one, sir. Over here. Yep. Keep going. Perfect. What is that? A Dodge Hellcat? That thing's nice. I like it. It's like a green. Emerald green. That's pretty sweet. All right. Yep. Crank you to the left. There you go. Thank you for leaving some room. So as you can see, the other person we will just go right here. Oh, oh, oh. Not off the ship. Okay. Yeah, yeah. You might want to turn the parking brake on. There you go. Yeah, turn it off. Turn it off. Okay. And then also, as you can see, we have straps on the boat. So when we do have all the cars loaded up, we're going to strap all the vehicles down so they don't fall off the side. Uh, the back end does not have a lift gate, but the front does. As you can see up here, when we do leave, this will lift up, which is pretty cool too. Uh, yeah, I'm going to go jump back into the pilot seat or the captain seat, and uh, we'll make sure that there's more cars showing. Actually, there's another one. There it is. Jeez, who is this? He's flying in here. Jeez. Aston Martin? Is that James Bond? How's it going, sir? DBS Aston Martin. All right. Ticket is paid for. So they all have a window sticker uh, for their ticket, so... Yep. Crank it to the left there. There you go. Watch that. Perfect. Okay. Vehicle number two is loaded up. We could probably get in a third vehicle here, but we don't like to take the chances with the weight. So, uh, yeah, we're going to wait for the third vehicle and the fourth vehicle, and then we're going to probably head out here. And I think the third vehicle is coming through the front gate right now. Once they pay their toll over there, see where all those vehicles are lined up, uh, they're able to be sent through. And uh, the gate master does send them all through. So here we go. Oh, whoa. That's a nice car. Jeez, we're getting a bunch of nice cars today. Hey, red Ferrari. I like that thing. That's more of my speed. Yep, you're in the middle, sir. Go ahead, stop right there. Perfect. All right, one more vehicle. Gate Master radioing in. Uh, how many more vehicles do you have left? Uh, we just sent through the uh, fourth and final vehicle for this load, but you're going to have to come back for a second load. A uh, second load? How many vehicles you got at the gate? Uh, we have a total of eight today, so you're going to have to take another four load, and then you'll be done. All right, sounds good. We're making two trips, four ways, guys. It's going to be pretty crazy, but this is... Oh, my gosh, that's a bigger truck. What is that, Ford Raptor? This thing's giant. All right, yep, right there. Yeah, Jesus is taking up the whole thing. So this is what I was talking about. We can't get five cars on this thing, but we're going to strap it down. There we go. Let's get this one strapped down. All right, Aston Martin and Dodge Hellcat is secure. So let's climb back up to the helm, and we're going to get going here. So everybody's just going to wait in their vehicles. When you're on a ferry, you kind of just sit out and chill, and you get to watch the view. So we're backing out here of the canal. We kind of got this little system with all the markers there that shows us where to go so we don't you know, ground the ship into a shallow part of the ocean here. So let's back out. We're going to spin it around here. Looks good. We got the radar going. I think we're uh, ready to blast off to Billionaire's Island. So, should be pretty good. And the reason they call it Billionaire's Island is they've got a very nice house there. Actually, 10 of them. And there's 10 billionaires that live on the island. And they all pretty much head over here on Thursdays for the weekend. And then they come home about Sunday night. So, we might need to make a return trip. So, if you'd want to see us do that, make sure to drop a like. But we're moving here, boys. We are uh, we're going about 20 knots. This thing is not slow. Most ferries you'll see go about 10 miles per hour. But we're able to go a little bit faster than that, about 22 since we do strap the load down. Uh, most ferries don't do that, but we do have that option because we can go faster. So pretty cool. Uh, let's check the radars here. Looks good. Systems are go. 
I think we're just going to radio it in to uh, Coast Guard, let them know that we're going to be trespassing onto the waters of the island. We do have to let them know. We're not trespassing, but we do have to let them know we're going to be entering their waters here. So. Billionaire's Island, Billionaire's Island. This is the ferry from Waterworld. Over. Billionaire's Island, go ahead. Uh, yeah, we're approaching the island to the ferry dock located on the south end of the island. We have uh, four vehicles with us, uh, Ford Raptor, Ferrari, Aston Martin, and a Dodge Hellcat. Okay, sounds good. Uh, we'll meet you down at the dock. All right, thank you very much. We'll be approaching in about five minutes. Roger that. Standing by. Channel 34. Here we go, boys. We're getting pretty close here. I think, yeah, the ferry dock's over here. I forgot kind of where it was, but you can see there's actually a big mansion up on that hill, and then there's about 10 scattered around the other sides of the island, so... All right, let's go ahead. We're going to slow our speed down here. We don't want to be going in with a wake here. There we go. We're entering the channel. Okay. Don't take out any of the markers here. Nice and smooth. Okay, that was tough. All right. The first vehicle should be uh, good to unload here. Let's go ahead. We're going to unstrap the load. All right. Take the straps off the vehicles, and they're ready to back off. Ford Raptor, you're first. Let's go. All right. He fired it up. Looks good. That thing's a nice truck. Look at this. Look at those wheels. Oh, okay. Hold on. I got to bring up the height of the gate here. All right, next up is the Ferrari. Here he goes. It should be a little bit better. I raised it up with the supercars. Yeah, there we go. It's got to be perfect because those things don't have uh, the truck suspension. Uh, but yeah, it looks pretty good. We might actually need to come down about an inch or two, but vehicles are taking them up. This guy, wow, that's a nice house. Hold on, I got to get a little bit closer. Check that thing out. That's a giant mansion. And check out his view. He looks at the mountains. It's just the best spot on the island, I would think. So, all right. Next up is the Aston Martin, the DBS. Is this, this might be James Bond. Uh, it's possible. He might have a mansion or two hiding out around here. So, there he goes. All right, the next up is the Dodge Hellcat. You're clear to go, sir. Take it easy. I suggest you pull over here and then you back out. Yep, crank it. There you go. Looks good. Oh, watch it. Watch it. Straight back, straight back. Yep, yep. Might have took out a mirror cap or two, but all right. He's off the ship. Jeez, that guy was kind of crazy. Oh, my gosh. No, it's just sank it in the water there. There he goes. All right. Well, I think our uh, we're all clear here. Let's go ahead. We're going to go ahead back off here. Head back to Waterworld Mainland. And then we've got the next set of four vehicles. We do need to radio in back to uh, the dispatch center there and the gatehouse, the gatekeeper, we call them. And make sure that the four cars are still ready and stand by. And make sure that there's no other cars because if there is, we'll have to take a third load. And I'm praying we don't. But... I'll see you guys back at the mainland. Yeah, this is Sledgehammer, ready to in back to the mainland water world. Uh, how many vehicles you got waiting at the gate? Uh, I sent them back through. They should be waiting uh, right by the loading area for the Sledgehammer. All right, copy that. Sounds good. We're about T-minus 15 minutes out from Waterworld Main Gate. Uh, I'll meet you back there. Sound good? Roger that. Standing by. Channel 34. This is Sledgehammer, standing by. 34. All right, boys, we're moving along here. Since we don't have vehicles, we're actually going quicker right now. We're going about, meh, 30 miles an hour. It's not slow. This thing has got... To win 2,000 horsepower diesel engines, so it's not slow. You can actually see them down there. They are pods. So what pods are is they rotate. Gives a lot better maneuverability. So hold on. I got to check the radar here. I think we're a little bit off course. We got to steer a little bit to the left, and then we'll be loading up very shortly. Yeah, we're pulling in here. Get the lines ready. Copy that. Cars are ready to go. Roger that. Here we go, boys. We're pulling back in. Let's find the channel markers. Okay, there we go. We got to go out a little bit and then bring it around. That way we're straight on with the channel here. So looks good. Come on, crank it. Oh my gosh, this thing is swinging. Oh, we're drifting a boat. There's no way. All right, hold on. Straighten it back out. There we go. The cars are lining up here, so we should be ready to roll out. It'll make it a little bit quicker, the whole process, now that they're all through the gate. And let's go ahead and hit the reverse. Oh, geez. Coming in hot. But the best part is this can come in hot because we have these giant fenders on front of the boat. We've also got tires. we got old retired tires on the uh, side of the boat. So if we need to hit anything, we pretty much can. So, all right, let's go. Uh, let's go check in with all the vehicle owners. I think there's a Mustang, some sort of Porsche. There's actually a unspecified third vehicle. I don't think it's an actual car. So we'll have to find out. Sometimes people bring like buggies and other off-road stuff. So, uh, yeah, you could send them through Gatekeeper. Let's make sure we keep this process moving here. Whoa, okay, slow it down. I should probably stand there and let them know. Mustang, uh, slow it down, please, sir. You're going to be taking this left spot over here. Yep, crank it around straight through. Straight, straight, straight. Looks good. All right, crank it to the right. Oh, that's got a lot of power. That's a Ford Mustang RTR Spec 5. Wow, that's like a special kit. They've got it all tuned up here, so. All right, next vehicle, clear to go through. It looks like it's a Porsche. What is that, a GT3 RS? Whoa, look at that thing. That's a nice car. Look at the spoiler on that. Don't scrape it. Yep, crank it to the right. Nice and easy. Straight, straight, right, right. Okay, easy, easy, easy. Yep, jeez, he's getting pretty close. His Mustang should have went forward a little bit more, but he made it. There you go. You're clear, you're clear. I'll strap it down up here. Good, perfect. All right, turn off the vehicle, please, sir. All right, next vehicle is up. 
Oh, he took out another one of my cones. Nice. Okay. Can and Maverick. All right. We'll strap this one down here. There we go. Oh my gosh. All right. He's all good there. And what's the next vehicle? Uh, gatekeeper. We got another vehicle coming on. Yeah, but uh, it's the unspecified one. We're supposed to be slot three. All right. What, uh, which one is it? Uh, it's heading towards you. Look. Oh, is that camper? No, he's taking out my cones. Hey, what do you think you're doing? Oh my gosh. Hey, 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 hey. Oh my gosh, you just took out the K&M. But I think it's the same guy. Is this your... Yeah, that's his K&M. He's got slot three and four. Okay, well, uh, are we gonna be able to fit this thing on? Um, hold on, hold on, hold on, sir. I'm gonna have to move your K&M for you. All right, what I'm thinking is he's gonna have to go... No, 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 keep the folds out in, sir. Fold out, fold out in. All right, straight forward. I think it'll fit through the tunnel here. Straight in the middle. There we go. Good thing we don't have a, a fourth vehicle with us. That's a full size. Yep. All right. That'll be good. Jeez. Look at the clearance on the roof. It's like perfect. All right. Kill it there. Stay inside of your vehicle. Please uh, don't get out. All right. Well, you're basically not able to. You're kind of trapped. So let us know if you got any problems. All right. We're pulling away here. There we go. Looks good. We got all four vehicles here. That camper is giant. I don't think uh, we're going to be able to cruise at 40. We're probably going to be cruising at about 15, 14 miles per hour. It's going to be a little slower. You know, the more weight, the slower we go. So we'll do our best, but it's gonna be it's gonna be a good trip back. This is our second and final trip for the day. We've got no other registered vehicles moving along here. Like I said, most people do head over to the island on Thursday evening. It's really not any other people that show up on Friday. They're pretty much already there. And like I said, it's like ten houses. There's not many people on the island. Probably at most there would ever be is like Fourth of July weekend. There's probably about 40, 50 people. Uh, because people do have guests and everything. But for the most part, average weekends, maybe 20 people. 10 houses and there's two people per per, per house. So it's, uh, it's not too bad. So I'll catch you guys when we're getting ready to unload here. And uh, then we'll be done for the day. The shift will be over. And we get paid $745 for the trips we've made today. That does not include the expenses for the fuel and also the docking fees that does cost a little bit of money since we're entering different waters and everything but um we did get paid 750 so it's not bad you take it up against five hours because loading up and all that stuff it's like over 100 hours and we get to drive a nice nice giant cruise ship here so this thing's pretty cool and uh yeah meet you guys at the island okay we're approaching the channel right now i think the camper just started or something i don't know why that guy has got his vehicle running they are not allowed to have their vehicles running when we are in moving right now but all right we'll pull up there we go nice and slow five feet four feet three feet hey hey who says you could unload no way he didn't even wait for me to get down there and open the gate he just backed over the thing oh my gosh all right well let's get the rest of these guys out here i think this is his can ham here too We'll go ahead and move it for him. Then the other two guys up front, the Porsche and the Mustang, we'll move them too. But geez, that guy he didn't even hesitate to wait. There we go. Take your can am. There we go. All right, boys. Mustang, Porsche, you're up next. Let's get the uh, vehicles unstrapped here. There we go. All right, Porsche, go ahead. You're clear. Yep. This one's a little tight too, this spot. There you go. Crank it around. Yep. Watch the Mustang. Good, good, good. Clear. Have a good day, sir. Thank you for paying. And also, if you guys don't know, the price for a ticket is uh, $65. So every car... We get paid about 65 bucks. Not too bad. It's about $500 and we get paid more than that. So works out pretty good. But some days are more because if we have more more people going back and forth. So sometimes this uh, this company that I work for will make more money. But Mustang is up next. I think the guy's in the bathroom. You can get out. There's a bathroom over here and this door here. So I think he's probably there, but he's going to unload his Mustang. Well, guys, thank you for watching today's episode. If you did enjoy watching us uh, take the Waterworld Ferry across the Billionaire's Island, make sure to drop a thumbs up down below and subscribe if you haven't already, guys. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you in the next one. Oh.